yeah, so here we are hopping in. Eddie G and Lunic. One life to play Eddie G. Team Goth Girls Lunic. Yo, let's go. I love that Lunic has a hat with his name embroidered on it. Like, someday I want to have that much confidence to just walk around with, like a Sam hat. So when I first met uh, the player who has, who's responsible for my, my growth in Smash, Sabrook, uh, I met him. He had a light blue hat with gold stitching that said Sabrook on it. And I thought he was the biggest tool on planet Earth, <laughs> and I wasn't wrong. But we're getting into game one, Eddie G and, uh, was it Lunik? Yeah, said? Lunik. Lunik is from Dayton. Uh, I guess kind of, kind of Dayton area. He plays in Dayton mostly. Okay, outside yeah, Dayton. that's not too far from here. Yeah, and you won Eddie. Our, I don't actually know where Eddie One Life to play would be Neo, if I believe I am correct. Okay. But uh, Lunik won our last monthly here in Columbus, played all Bowser. Okay. I guess he played oh, one set of that forward air. Not gonna kill just yet. Really missed that forward air there. Um, post nerf Peach, does Bowser win this matchup now? I mean, it was kind of sketchy before because Bowser's so fast. Like people underrate Bowser so hard. Bowser uh, moves really quickly. Uh, frame six command grab. That's like ridiculous. Killing um, Eddie right there off the top. Uh, I don't know. It might be a matchup that Peach could struggle in now because forward air is not going to be as potent as a kill move. Back throw is not going to kill as early. Uh, that's pretty big deals for Peach, you know, to be honest. Yeah, it is. Uh, I feel like Bowser has such an easy time edge guarding Peach in this matchup. It's like to all of us, like Bowser can kind of just run off stage and run off in forward air. Yeah. <laughs> forward air is pretty good. Bowser at 136% still yeah. in it. That counter not going to do anything. Toad has uh, set knockback and damage. So no matter how strong the hit is, it will always do, I think it's like 18% and have the same uh, knockback no matter what, whether it's jab or smash attack, for those who don't know. I did not know that. Well, the more you is know. Is that the only counter in this game that works that way? Yes. Forward air, you see, look at that, nerf coming into play. <laughs> Forward air, 159, not taking the stock just yet. Yeah, Bowser's big, Bowser's not that big. Yeah, that that's gonna should kill, be a stock. Yep. Oh, my, he exploded. Yeah, three, one stock lead right now for MVD. Eddie G's gotta figure something out quick or else. Yeah, Eddie G's doing Looking very, a very good right now. 174 Ooh. to 36, oh, 63, goodness. No. I can see why he won the last monthly. <laughs> He's trying to disrespect him with that down B there. Yeah, Lunik is good, Lunik is, uh, he was, he was playing Bowser since Up day one. Jesus. Also plays uh, King K. Rule, but you know, King K. Rule. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, nice uh, solid back there there by Eddie G. Taking the stock finally. Back there. <laughs> yeah, eat that back there. Well, back there for a back there, you know? JV3 for Lunik. Yeah, that was that was rough. That was rough. Lunik thinking about it, figuring out what he wants to ban. I'm assuming in this matchup, he'd want to ban like town and city, probably. I mean,. Probably especially now, because like now that the forward air is nerfed and it's not going to kill as early, Town and City does have the shortest side blast zone, so that would make sense. Uh, we got a pretty solid crowd out there. But yeah, he has three bands, so I would assume Town, um, maybe Smashville, and we're running it back. Well, <laughs> running it back. Uh, there was somebody in chat said any big bodies, heavies that do not have command grabs. Bowser does not have Bowser. I mean, uh, Donkey Kong does not actually have a command yeah, grab. Yeah, DK has regular, no command grab. Regular uh, grab. I guess technically King K. Rool does, but like... Rob is a heavy, isn't he? Rob would be classified. Nah, I don't consider heavy, nah. Well, he, they... he was heavy in Brawl, wasn't he? Is he lighter yes. in this game? Yeah, right. he is lighter in this game, yeah. All right, all right. Uh, speaking of Rob, speaking of the devil, yeah, Eddie G hobbit, switching to Rob. Hopping out with a Rob right here. I think that's a much better pick for the matchup and yes. just in general. Rob, just, he can space Bowser out. Like, right, Bowser has a hard time getting in on Rob. Yeah, but Rob has projectiles that, you know, they're not the best. Like, Gyro's very good, uh, but it's more so just to keep Bowser out, as you said. Yeah, that um, keep-away game. Yeah, Nair is very good against Bowser. Uh, you know, the Rotom Arm, Side B's very potent move against Bowser as well. Just sits and can you, can he just roll back out of that flame breath when he's caught like that? Uh, can you, he just roll you behind can't, Bowser? Because it'll, it'll catch the rolls, like, starter right. frames. Learning. Because rolls are not 100% invincible in this game. That's not going to kill yet. Yeah, no. That's like 20%, though. That's a lot of damage. Yeah, I think unscale or un, uh, uh, stalled, it does, stalled, staled, it does, uh, 24%. What, Fire Breath? Uh, no, the uh, Side B. Oop, there 24? we go. 24? Pretty sure it's 24%. I could be wrong. I don't know if it's 24, but that, that is still a lot. No, I'm at 20. It's over 20, but I'm... Yeah, it's a, it's a lot. But yeah, Eddie, Eddie G so definitely, much damage. definitely doing better. Flame Breath, that's like a free 40%. Into the up, he's 61. 61%? Just like in two seconds. Yeah, down smash, putting him to 80%, just about 135. Getting closer to death percent on both sides, actually, now. 
Ooh, bad air dodge. Gonna recover though. Ooh, Ooh nice down air. Yeah, really really nice. Getting the awkward stage spike. That's, that's the Rob special where he turns your edge guard into his own edge guard. See that? That's the uh, that wouldn't have happened on PS2. You know, for those who are uh, arguing between the legality of PS1 or PS2, that only happened because the lip exists there. Where do you fall in the debate, PS1, PS2? Uh, I prefer PS1, but I understand that it is a worse stage objectively than PS2, so PS2 it is. All right, so back in this match. So, yeah, definitely, Eddie G has made some adjustments here on the Rob. Obviously still down a bit, but... Oh, yeah. It, I mean, it couldn't have looked a whole lot worse than last game. I guess getting actually three stocks, but... Yeah, you, you can't get much worse than JV2, you know? Yeah, that's, that's, that's a rough one. Yeah. Yeah, some nice gyro plays there. Yeah, that, that's, that's kill definitely a stock. Sure. <laughs> yeah, that is... Uh, that's not what you're looking for there. No, not at all. But he can still bring it back. You know, uh, oh, Rob does have a lot of early kill options, very strong options. Um, right, right forward there, smash? Right. Almost, just about. Ooh, good stall in the recovery by by uh, Lunix there. Yeah, I love when people wait on the recovery. It's one of, my, it's one of those like, little things in Smash that I was like, oh, it's so cool. Yeah, it's like you knew that you knew they were going to hit you, so you delayed your recovery slightly. All, did he really combo the second hit of up smash into back air? Oh, right. oh no, not quite enough right. to get him back. Lunic is absolutely a lunatic. Yeah, and man. another back air to seal the game. Immediately spawns in, gets the back air. Those revenge hits, I swear, it happens so often. Eddie G with the, uh, he was laughing, he was having a good time there with Lunic. Uh, so in, the, in between, someone in chat asked, MVD, where is Mario on your tier list in terms